Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from the up-to-date sandwich book of 1909, we're going to be making the Frankfurt sausage sandwich. Mm. This is not exactly difficult. So, sliced Frankfurter onto buttered bread. Sprinkle that with chopped pickles. Okay, let's give this Frankfurt sausage sandwich a go. Frankfurter, not too dissimilar from a hot dog. Pickles and butter. <laughs> it's not bad, but I do want to plus it up. First, I'm going to add some chopped onions. I'm going to add some coarse Dijon mustard. And yes, I am well aware German mustard would have been probably more appropriate, but we don't have any in the house right now, so coarse grain Dijon it is. Okay, let's give this Frankfurt sausage sandwich plus up a little diced onion and coarse grain Dijon mustard. There go. Obviously, it's kind of eating like a hot dog sandwich, and I am okay with that. Now, if you took a look at the size of those Frankfurters and you thought, that's too big for a Frankfurter, you're right. I bought jumbo Frankfurters from this European market, and uh, they're big, but hey, what are you going to do? The original Frankfurt sausage sandwich was okay. Um, it wasn't bad. I'll give it a five and a half. Plussed up with a little uh, onion, diced onion, and some coarse grain Dijon mustard, I'll give it a six and a half. It is tasty. I will finish it. I don't know that I would do this preparation of the uh, Frankfurter again. Um, I'll probably find some other way to enjoy it, like fry it up or grill it. But um, yeah, I'll finish this. Why not? <laughs> All right. See you tomorrow.